Golf course at Martin County State Park are off. The foundation that wanted to build the course has withdrawn their proposal. Environmentalists came out in force against the Department of Environmental Protection's initiative to develop nine of our state parks. Yeah, the DEP wanted to bring in more visitors by adding golf courses and pickleball courts and hotels as well. That sparked an outcry saying that protected habitats and animals would be adversely affected. And now the DEP is pushing back its public meetings to allow for more input. And Wink News reports Reporter Claire Golf is live at Lover's Key. So Claire, what is the reaction to the latest development? Well, most people that I talked to here at Lover's Key State Park told me uh, public meeting or no public meeting, the response will be the same. Don't touch the state parks. Now, just to be clear, Lover's Key State Park here is not on the list. Actually, no Southwest Florida parks are. But one woman I met today told me she fears that if this becomes a reality, her little oasis could be next. I love this. This is my favorite child, of the olives. <laughs> Moments like these are the reason Kristen Malafi told me she's been coming to Lover's Key State Park since she was a little girl. We gotta see if we can find some dolphins. Now she collects shells and splashes in the waves here with her little girl, Morgan. <laughs> this is this is my second home. You know, like right now, it's really peaceful and calm and relaxing. But Malafi was fired up when she ran to me on the state park sand Monday afternoon. Matt. The Florida Department of Environmental Protection is looking at proposals to develop nine state parks from Miami to the Panhandle and build golf courses, pickleball courts and hotels. No Southwest Florida parks are on the list now, but Malafi fears if the state does it somewhere, they can do it anywhere. What happens when all of these trees go away? Where are all of these birds going to go? What happens to all these animals that are on the verge of extinction? What happens to them? And Malafi is not alone in her anger. Monday, the DEP decided to push back public hearings to next week after seeing outcry across the state. From environmental groups and in a rare sign of unity, both Republican and Democratic lawmakers. State Senator Jonathan Martin from Fort Myers told me there's not reason to worry, at least not right now. Of course, with the input uh, from Republican state legislators all over the state, including myself, uh, these, these projects are not going to happen without um, a lot more discussion. Now, I will add that not everybody that I met here today is mad about the possible changes. Uh, I met a couple tourists who said pickleball courts and golf courses just mean all the more reason to visit Southwest Florida. Of course, though, neighbors, um, most of them are not budging. Now, I'm working to find out exactly when and where those meetings will be next week. I'll update you as soon as I have them. Live at Lover's Key State Park, I'm Claire Galt, Wink News. All right.